What's up, guys? It's Rice of the Underdogs. And uh, I decided to record this because I got done recording Identity Crisis Episode 8. And um, by the way, before this, before I start recording right now, I fought this kid, right? He was from Brazil. Let me tell you guys something. Do not fight Brazilian players, all right? Like, if you know a Brazilian player that's good, fight him. But do not fight random Brazilian players. Never in your life dare to do such a thing. I just fought this kid. His name, Gamer Tag was like the innovator or some bullshit. Dude. Oh my god. Yeah, he, he is right here, man, right? This kid. His connection is horrible. It's booty, dude. Like, and then the thing is, yeah, like Chiyo with Neji and, um, what was it? And Tsuchikage, bro. I know Goro Tajutsu plays legit. I fought him. I fought him. Nah, I, did I fight him once? Nah, I, I was in a tournament with him, but I saw him play. But, anyways, that other kid that I was telling you about, the innovator kid, he. Oh man, dude, it was just horrible. Kashimaro suggested this character. And I'm gonna use him right now. And I'm gonna most likely lose. But I don't give a fuck. At least I'm gonna lose to a good player that knows how the fuck to play, right? Uh, I mean, that's the best I could ask for right there. Oh my god, that Brazilian kid, his connection must be from like Mumbai or some shit, dude, because that, that, oh my god, that delay, it was just horrible. But whatever, man. You know, that's behind us now. Let's just try to focus on this shit right here. You know? Alright. Damn, man, like, <laughs> yo, man, he knows how to conserve his chakra, man, like, uh, with the, uh, relay and stuff. That was nice. Oh, shit. Can't believe my team bar's already up. Oh, shit. Nice. Nice. Can't believe I got that off. <clears throat> oh shit. Yo, Taijutsu got the moves, man. Taijutsu got the moves, bro. That motherfucker ain't letting me touch him, bro. Even though he's like at a disadvantage and shit with subs and crap. Ah, I fucked up that. Fuck you, Jirai, you cunt! Aww. I hate when my guard breaks, man. It's like, you're so vulnerable, you can't do shit, man. All you can do is watch as you get fucked in the butt. Mumbai! Shit. For Mumbai! Ah, oh, shit, I got fucked up. <laughs> uh, I tried to throw out one of those shoot again things and failed horribly. That was a good game, though. That was a really good game. And, you know, shout out to Kashimaro. But let's go to the second match. Alright, guys, so. We're in the second match. And I'm gonna use Meiterumi again, because, you know, I kinda like using her. And I don't give a fuck what people say. I'm gonna pick uh, Karin. Raha. Uh, and I noticed I haven't been on PS3 for like a whole week. I, I got an online and then just signed right back off, but I haven't played at all. Oh man, look at this team. Ah, uh, Kakusu B Mash time, baby. But, anyways, like I was saying, yeah, like, uh, when I'm done recording the few batch, uh, well, the batch of videos here on SBODs, I'll probably hop on there. Um, actually, you know, tomorrow I'll hop on there because, um, you know, maybe tomorrow I'm going to have some time to do that. There you go. That was a nice. That was a nice little combo. That, not combo, but combination. I guess I should say. Yeah, yeah. Gotta be careful, guys. You know what it is. Oh man, he's gonna awaken. Why is it that when I use Metanumi, I always gotta deal with an awakening, dude? Come on, game. Come on, game. What? My guard broke? Okay, then, game. Oh, shit. 
people are too thirsty, man. They, I mean, you know, it's understandable. You don't like to lose. Nobody does, right? And then my guard keeps fucking breaking. That's cool. Wow, okay. So my jutsu doesn't protect me from shit. That's good news, game. <clears throat> All right. Well, like I was saying, yeah, um, nobody likes to lose, but dude, like, if somebody's playing you legit, bro, somebody, somebody's playing you the right way, somebody's kicking your ass, just take the ass beating, dude. Like, oh my god, he just, <laughs> he dashed right back into the lava thing. I could get, I could kill him with just chip damage, too, if I keep doing jutsu, but obviously, I'm not gonna just, I'm not gonna attempt that. There you go. Beat him with the kunai. That kid was a scrub too, and I almost lost, uh, That which was surprising. That fucking awakening is amazing. But let's go to a third match, peeps. Alright guys, so I believe this is the third match now. And as far as underdogs go, I believe Jiraiya's one of them, right? Mm, Alright, I'll use him, yeah, like, I, I don't know. I, I the last moment I had like a second thought there, but whatever, so it doesn't matter now. It's gonna go with it. Okay, man, this guy, look at this guy, man. I didn't expect anybody to use a team like this. All right, all right, okay. Let's see what he has then. Let's see what he can do with that Itachi, man. Hopefully it's not just tilts and beam mashing, though. Hopefully. All I can do is hope. Get out of my face. Ooh. He picked a really bad Kakashi though, man, like a support, which is actually surprising. You know, because usually you see people using like the most OP shit on rank. But this guy, this guy don't give a fuck, man. He's like, nah, I'm a Duke Nukem this shit. Dude, <laughs> fucking Till is like uh, like the best defense for Itachi, bro. It's really helpful. It's a really helpful tilt. That's what I mean. Hey, ya bitch. Oh shit. Ooh, barely. Barely got that. Alright, you know, it was an okay match. It was an okay match. Let's just do one more and then call it a day. Alright, guys, so it's the final match. And then, sadly, why not use Sabusa, man? Sabusa is one of those cats that you never see people use. And I, I guess the best setup would be either Haku or the Mitsukage. But given the circumstances, let me just use Haku. I mean, I could use a Mizukage and, and then, you know, just have some somebody to uh, help me out when I'm in a jiffy, but eh, I'm just going to use uh, Hako because it's, it's the best team to go with, I guess. Oh, man, that team. I, I hope he doesn't do what a lot of Sakura players like to do. Because uh, I've seen Sakura, they block your combos, and then what they do is tilt. Because, you know, they automatically fuck you up with that tilt. Oh, 10-10. Why you do this, Dan Dan? Yeah, hey, that's what I was talking about. Say, like, it fucks you up pretty easily. You're easily fucked. Oh my god. That fucking tilt, man. It annoys the shit out of me. Ah. Uh. Yeah, fucking tilt again, man. This kid's pissing me off now. Herp -er -derp. Get out of there, Tantan, you old bitch. 
My God, stop with the fucking tilt, man. Jesus, we get it. We get it. You can do a fucking tilt. We understand that much. My God. Such a lucky fuck. Grab that ass. Oh man, he didn't die. There you go. Man, that tilt gets irritating quick, man. And you know what? I understand why he did it, but goddamn, dude. It's just annoying to get hit by it. But I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm out. Peace.